Hi everyone, in this video we'll talk about best practices for input images that will get you the best results with KDIM. You can view the input image guidelines at any time in the app by clicking view input requirements or by visiting our documentation at docs.kdim3d.com. Input guidelines vary between asset types, so it's important to note the type of asset you're creating before uploading your images. First, we'll go over general suggestions that apply to all asset types. Any uploaded image of an object, whether it be concept art, a sketch, or a photograph, are accepted. For all asset types except scenes, your image must be of a single object. If you have an image with multiple objects, you can use the scene feature to generate it. If you're using prototype, we recommend separating the objects in your image first before uploading them as separate generations. If you're uploading multiple images, they must all be of the same object from different angles. We highly recommend having orthographic views of your object or character. If you don't have multiple views, we suggest a three-quarter view of your object or character to ensure the best possible result. Next, you'll want to make sure that the object in your image is clearly distinguishable from the background. The background does not have to be a single color. Kdom automatically removes the background from your images after you've uploaded them. So it is recommended to have your object in focus and contrasted against the background. For creating characters and hero assets, we recommend generating your asset with the game ready pipeline for the best results. Here are a few examples of input images that are best for game ready. This character is complex and has multiple accessories. These details may not be captured with prototype but can easily be captured by the Game Ready pipeline. If you're not able to use Game Ready, we recommend using the Ultra Quality to generate complex characters and props using the prototype asset type. However, some details may be omitted. Realistic humans, animals, and foliage are not able to be generated with the prototype asset type. We suggest a Game Ready pipeline for these types of assets. In the texture settings in the create page, select realistic for the texture style. Thank you for watching our input guidelines video. For more examples on good and bad input images, please visit our documentation at docs.kdom3d.com.